Hello, I'm Daniela Gibb. I'm playing Kathy in Ooh. the last five years at the back room at the Star in Guildford. Come, come, come. Okay, some quick fire questions for you. Okay. Wine or beer? Oh, wine. Uh, cats or dogs? Dogs. Andrew Lloyd Webber or Jason Robert Brown? Jason Robert Brown. If you had a superpower, what would it be? Well, I want to be invisible. Invisible. Um, <laughs> favorite day of the week? Sunday. Your favorite food? Broccoli. <laughs> I love broccoli. Okay. Your favorite <laughs> holiday destination? Oh, I've just been to Budapest, I'll have to say there. Who would be your ideal dinner party guest? This is so hard. I think, I've sp spent many hours talking about this in dressing rooms, and I think I want um, Elizabeth I. I know she's really old and really dead and ginger, but um, <laughs> but um, I just think it'd be fascinating because I love the Tudor history and I want to find out about her dad and it's probably a bit dull, she's a bit more cool, but I think Queen Elizabeth I. What is it about theatre that you love? I love just being in a theatre, all the old theatres you see around the UK and in London are the the architecture and the dressing rooms and I have to think of all the jobs I do as much as I love being on stage I love the camaraderie of a company and I love being in a girls dressing room and like all the banter that happens and the chat and it's such a wonderful place to work it's so sociable and it's it's just so alive as well I can't imagine doing anything else how did you get into performing I did the usual little girl thing I suppose of going to ballet lessons at the age of three in the white dress and pink sash and did dancing until I was about 18 to not, you know, standard level. Um, and then I went to drama school in Guildford, which is why it's so nice to be back here now because I spent three years here at drama school. Um, and then very, very fortunately was able to leave college early and go and do a show in London. So I, did, I guess a standard route compared to some people who are sort of discovered in tubes and stuff like that. But mm. yeah, I did the, all the dance training, all the drama school training and then got to do it for real. <laughs> And how are you enjoying playing Kathy? I am, I'm really enjoying it. It's nice to be, it sounds daft, a grown up. I'm so often cast as young people, or I was, and I just come off of Avenue Q, so I was not even human for the last seven months. So um, it's been, it's nice to have, it's a really meaty role, it's a wonderful female role, and emotionally challenging and, and really vocally challenging because. You know, it's such a, it can be really big singing. It's got lots of belting stuff, which is making me work hard on technique, and also the whole way that her story's backwards, which is a challenge because you've got to put yourself in theatre. Everything always happens chronologically. You always start at the beginning and finish at the end. And although this is still theatre, you or I have to kind of have done all of my journey before the curtain even goes up, and be at the end of her journey and then try my way backwards so I've been trying to listen to her songs backwards and sort of learn what the journey is and then hopefully it will come together on stage. Good. <laughs>